Light test, this is without the ring light. Light test number two, with the ring light. What do you think? What's up everybody, my name is Blake and welcome to my YouTube channel, Everything Except Nothing. Today I'm going to go over how to make a DIY light ring. Now I know there are many videos online and on YouTube on how to make light rings, but I needed one, so I figured I'd go ahead and post one, so let's check it out. So for this project, we're gonna use a half inch thick MDF board and I'm going to cut it 20 by 20 so that I have a little bit of excess material for 18 inch ring light. Um, use a chalk line, snap it straight. I am going to use a jigsaw for the whole project, that way I only have to use one tool. And now I'm going to find center of my board, which would be 10 inches, um, both directions, so that I can place a nail there. And what that nail is going to do is allow me to tie a string to a marker and create two perfect circles so I have something to cut out. Now um, just tying the string and make sure the knots are loose enough or the loops are loose enough that the marker can move freely. And we'll go ahead and draw the interior circle. And now we can cut it out with the jigsaw. Now you want to be sure to go really slow and steady on this. That way you don't have to um, cut it twice. Uh, it's, it takes a little bit of practice but 5 16 drill bit right in the center and I'm going to use that as a pilot hole so I can get my jigsaw blade in there and go ahead and cut the interior circle and continuing to cut this out. Now the next step would be to sand the exterior and interior part of the rings as it is kind of rough. So I go ahead and use a 120 grit sandpaper on a sanding block for the exterior and then remove that from the block, the sandpaper from the block, and sand the interior as well. Now you're going to want to clean your work surface as well as get a wet rag and wipe down the piece of wood as you want to have adhesion work well and the adhesive strip will not stick if it's dusty. So this is $14 LED 16.4 feet uh, I got it on Amazon. The tape light is designed to go straight, so there is some crinkling that happens, and what you want to do is go ahead and push down on the LED so the LED is flat to the board, and then that crinkle is in between each LED. And go ahead and just push down, once that's done, push down on the flat sections to make sure you don't get too much dust on the back side of the adhesive that's bubbling up. And it does take a 12 volt, I believe, AC adapter and you go ahead and just plug it in and that is what powers the light and there it is fixed to my tripod. And here we go final product of my light ring attached to my current camera setup. Now I do want to mention that it is just zip tied to my camera stand. The reason being is because of the halo that's happening on my glasses I don't know if this is the configuration that I want to keep it in. I am going to build a different mounting system for it, however I want to make sure that the position is correct before I do that. So I will be posting an updated video on how to build the mounting for this and also the positioning for people who are wearing glasses. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. If you like my video, please like and subscribe and I will catch you guys on the next one.